Hey everybody, Gerald Malice here. Welcome back to another packing video. Me and Miss Malice have four items to ship today for our Star Wars Retro New Market, where we ship same day Monday through Friday until 2 p.m. First up, we got a awesome Game Boy game. Definitely a cool one of favorites of mine. Super Mario Land 2, the six golden coins. Now this one would be my faded label one that uh, we are shipping today. This one sold for 1970. It's going out to Jonathan in Ohio. Uh, this one was definitely just a awesome game for the Game Boy. The do 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 do. The, the, this the music. Uh, it was just bringing back a lot of memories. Sorry. Definitely one of the games that I enjoyed playing as a kid. Uh, I didn't really play Game Boys a lot because when I was super younger, when they first came out, uh, you know, we had Tiger handhelds, and even at best, I didn't even think I had a real Tiger handheld. I think I had one of those like generic tiger handhelds that were kind of like a tiger, but a knockoff tiger. Sorry, one of my favorite uh, viewers is going to be like, that's not true. You're going to see that uh, Leonardo DiCaprio pose like. <laughs> no, really, honestly, though, definitely a great game. You know, I like the fact that uh, Mario throughout its uh, inception kind of like molded so well with each new system they came out yeah, and you know you got this platformer and uh that just was able to transist all transcend all the systems you know same thing kind of like with a link you know legend of zelda so uh, able to just multi-platform top view or side scrolling it's just the, definitely the best games of those retro times so i'm rambling sorry about that i digress thank you very much jonathan over in ohio for the purchase now next up we have a pop and you know what i think only like two of these left i have to check but this is a fast times at ridgemont high linda barrett vinyl pop so this is the scene where she is in her red bikini uh, for the pool scene famously um, portrayed in a bunch of parodies like family guy and stuff like that and uh oh, sorry i had some plastic over it but this one came in one of my lot pickups for GameStop and my liquidations. I believe this one came out of Louisiana. This one is going to uh, Wayland. Wayland in Kansas paid $770 plus shipping. So let's get this up. And one more on the back side. And on the side. And then I'm going to do the bottom. And one more. And everybody that has been receiving their pops has been giving good feedback. So thank you very much for letting me know that the packaging gets the pop there in a safe manner. Now, on to the third item. Another Game Boy, but this one, Advance. And funny enough, we went from Mario... And now we're checking out Sonic Advance here for the Game Boy Advance. This one's going out to Michael over in New York. And Michael paid $24.70 for this copy. And definitely, if you look at the eBay pictures, they're all cleaned. They're all tested, showing on eBay. And I use uh, Tarnex and uh, abrasion, cleaning up the connectors and get everything restored if there's any troubles. And then I clean out the inside of the carts. So it makes it nice and neat and sterilized for sure. Because <laughs> there's years. I find years of gunk. Skin cells are pretty, pretty, pretty grody for sure. And they get caught up in everything. So everything. But thank you very much for that. Uh, for Michael in New York for the Sonic Adventures for Game Boy Advance 2470. Plus shipping. Last but not least, this is another Funko Pop. And this one's going over to Joey in North Carolina. Joey picked up this James Bond Odd Job vinyl that we sold for $9.70. Now, the Odd Job, one of my favorite memories of Odd Job besides the movie, which is a little bit before my time, was that he was a playable character in GoldenEye. And that being said, Odd Job was definitely the cheat, being a smaller hitbox and everything as well, for the character play within that game development. So, yeah, and everybody kind of knew it, and no one confirmed it, and then it was confirmed by the developers. So, Joey, hopefully you enjoy this odd job. 
And, you know, don't lose any statue heads throwing at anybody's that you like. So, let's get our tape on there. And I am horribly taping today. Didn't measure out at all. And these are the 7 by 5 by 5s It says it right there on the box. All right, Joey, thank you very much. And now we are on to the game of the day, Kirby and the Amazing Mira. I like Kirby. I like me some Kirby. I like me some NES Kirby. I like me some Super NES Kirby. No cap. Never played this Kirby. But I like Kirby. I rep Kirby. And uh, definitely, as you can see, 2D side scrolling. Anything like this is going to rock your socks. Man, it's in demo mode. <laughs> definitely check it out. Kirby in uh, the Magical Mirror. Uh, game you want to try. Game Boy Advance. Playing on the other stuff. Again, just found it, popped it in. Figured you'd like it. And it matched the shirt. If this type of content you like to see, definitely hit that like and subscribe button. As you can see, I've been posting way more uh, snips and videos of my daily dealings besides packing, actually buying stuff, so in video games mostly. So thank you for that as well. Links for the social media is down below, Discord, all that fun stuff. And we will be back here tomorrow with another video Thursday. Oh, last but not least, don't forget, I will be at Retro Mania from the 22nd and 23rd in New Braunfels. New Braunfels? New Braunfels. There you go. No S. I learned that today. Thank you very much, and we will see you back here next time.